It is about 7 o'clock in the morning here in Wisconsin. Hot and humid. It's already about 78, 80 degrees. And we're supposed to have a heat index warning today. The garden is not suffering because we have had quite a bit of rain weekly. And uh, lots of mosquitoes. That's my trumpet vine on that arch back there. And it's doing really super this year. Of course, it's aggressive, but I keep it trimmed every spring. Castor bean plants are loving this heat. Blue lobelia. This is the time of the year here that this shines. With, uh, uh, oh, let's see, that's Wyoming. Can't canna behind it. Gloriosa daisy, I let it come up here and there and everywhere. Joe Pie, back there it's gotten so tall. It's my roof vent where I have my last puppy buried. She's 16 years old. No more dogs. Can't go through the through the heartbreak anymore. The smoke bushes I have trimmed down, so you can see the stuff behind it, and also it helps with new growth coming back, being more purple. We will try. I will try to walk the garden and give you a morning view. Uh, I have a house plant out here called the bloodleaf plant and I use it in the garden. I take cuttings in spring and use it in the garden to give me some color all the time with the leaves. I'll take cuttings soon and bring in the uh, mother plant too and winter it downstairs. It's my sculpture. I tried something new down here this year. I used um, some more perilla, and I'm going to let it reseed in this area. It's under the maple tree and hot and dry, and it seems to do good. Purple emperor sedum. I don't know about you guys, but mine always stays quite leggy. Nothing like the autumn joy. Uh, that is the ornamental oregano. I won't, I'll try not to let it go to seed too much. I don't want it to be all over, but it's pretty right now. I deadheaded some. My ornamental kale is doing well. I did have to um, spray it for that little white butterfly that lays its eggs. And some basil. A pink allium. I think that's my latest blooming allium. And the joe pie. I repeat a lot in the garden uh, to give me a nice flow and I love the height of it. You can see my sculpture way down below. My bottle flower. Oops, it looks like it's kind of blurry. My Russian sage is all laying down because of the hard rain. I have to have a baffle on my bird feeder because I have raccoons. 
some more. This kale is called peacock. They say with the cooler weather coming on, it should get more purple. It's the first time I grew it, so we'll see. The hibiscus, this one here is Copper King, no more blossoms on it. But I do have blossoms on my, um, it's called Plum Crazy. This one's a taller one. I took some of my uh, red leather boots I had that got scuffed and I put in some uh, hens and chicks that are hardy here and get a red tip on them. Green with a red tip and then for the winter I just cover them with leaves and they winter okay then. balloon flower, that white one. Carl Forrester grass. And that's a, another copper king hibiscus. That darker leaf there. That miscanthus grass there really is, um, brightens up the garden. It is uh, called Dixieland, I think. Its variegation is mostly white with a little bit of green. It's my lantern. I found that at a, in the dumpster, I think, and just put in a blue vase. My um, meadow sage is blooming again. I cut it back. Gives me not as dense of flowers as before, but a little blue at least, or purpley blue. The Lamb's ear, big ears, this time of the year is looking good with the morning dew on it. This one here does not uh, get too many flowers on. Once in a while it'll get a flower and it stays this short. Garlic chives are starting to get their butt. Oh, I see a flower opening. This, everything's about now it seems about three weeks ahead of time. Uh, Gallardi, I keep deadheaded. Funny to say this with all the perennials I have, but Gallardia is my favorite. It just keeps going and going as long as I deadhead it. It is good. Another smoke bush, a young uh, miscanthus variegated, Dixieland. We're walking down into my shade area. This here is still the sunny part, but we'll walk down there. Blue balloon flower, some more kales, artemisia. I like it. I keep it in check every spring. Maybe even the fall takes them out. But I like the brightness of the silver. Oops, you see my shadow too. Copper King. My wild area. 